unfortunately for the Bucks and Hangman, they are no longer ROH World Six-Man Tag Team Champs. Ever since losing the Ring of Honor Six-Man Tag Team titles, the Young Bucks have had a different attitude. I kind of like it. I think it's going to give them an edge that they're going to need against Jericho and Omega. Well, a very angry Matt Jackson, as you can see. I always thought the Bucks had an attitude anyway. They easily get upset when things happen. But I think the version we're seeing of the Young Bucks right now is one that's always kind of been around. I think this is one of the most highly anticipated matches on Full Gear. This is about the future of one of the most elite groups of the last decade. On numerous occasions throughout, not just the history of AEW, but just throughout the past few years, Chris Jericho tried to destroy the elite. What was the whole point of the elite getting back together if none of us have each other's backs anymore? Is the anger towards Chris Jericho from the Young Bucks justified? My biggest problem is, who invited this prick into our locker room? Hey, you, you forget what this guy did to our father all those years ago? I haven't. I don't see how anyone could say that Kenny is doing the Bucks dirty by siding with Chris Jericho. Like Chris, hate Chris. Just think of it as like an enemy of my enemy thing. He is aligned with us against the Don Callis family. I guess the Bucks feel that Chris Jericho was never a part of the elite, so why should Kenny team with him? I even heard you had a really cool new name. The Golden Jets. Holy crap, I bet you came up with that, huh, Chris? You know another cool name? I remember one, the Elite. Just when we thought everything was smooth, we've seen some cracks reform. It's funny because you're such good friends with Kenny that you didn't have his back when Will Hobbs was beating the hell out of him a few weeks ago in the steel chair. Chris Jericho is not a man you can trust. Even though you might be the greatest tag team in the world, I'll give you all the credit for that. I still think that Jericho and Omega can beat you. Come on. Kenny Omega, our best friend, Chris Jericho versus Matt and Nick Jackson, the Young Bucks, the best tag tag team of all time. You said it yourself. Kenny has his own unique way of communicating with the Bucks. If you guys really want to face us, we'll do it. And then maybe you'll clean up your act, and maybe, quite frankly, you'll start acting like a real adults instead of a bunch of oh. sissy, whiny, bitchy children. That's, really? not, the, that's not the first time I've heard that. Wow. Right. No, but, okay. but you had to hear, I think you had to hear it from someone like me. Ready to fight. Let's go. Some very interesting stipulations in this match. How about when Jericho and Omega beat the Young Bucks at four here? That guaranteed title shot that you're sitting on goes to us. <laughs> How about when we beat you, because we will, right in the middle, clean as a whistle, Chris. It'll be you specific. How about this whole Golden Jets thing? That's no more. What shape will Chris Jericho and Kenny Omega be in at full gear when they have to face the Young Bucks with the future of the Golden Jets on the line? I was born ready.